Today was National Signing Day for high school football players. But Hattiesburg, uh, there was about as much drama involving a coach as it was any player. Southern Miss football fans gathered at mug shots at lunch today as the school signed over two dozen players for the next season. But it was a coach they didn't get and garnered plenty of attention. Earlier this week, head coach Jay Hobson interviewed former Baylor coach Art Bryles for the vacant offensive coordinator position. Bryles was fired three years ago after an investigation into misconduct in the Baylor Athletic Department found football coaches failed to report sexual assault complaints against players. Today, USM President Rodney Bennett issued a statement saying Bryles is not a candidate for the job. Coach Hobson, who apparently wanted to hire Bryles, issued his own statement disagreeing with the president's I mean, decision. Uh, I mean, uh, I say what I say, and I mean it to my, my, my heart, you know what I mean? And, and I'm not going to probably elaborate. It's just I said, and, I, and I, again, that's Jay Hobson. That's, I mean, I have to be me. My question, though, is, you know, is there, there are plenty of offensive coordinators out there, plenty of brilliant offensive mm -hmm. minds. Why focus on Bryles? Did you understand that? Because I thought he was a heck of an offensive coordinator. I defended a lot of offensive coordinators in my lifetime, and guess what? He was the best. How close are y'all to hiring Browns? You know, like I said, I, did, I, did y'all read my statement? <laughs> if you didn't, you can read Hobson's statement on our website. We'll have more on USM's signing day a little later in sports.